Microsoft keeps increasing the amount of features that are available, and you can find this information out by finding out what version you're on for your Windows operating system. So this is Windows 10 Pro, as you see here, but now we need to see what version it is of the operating system. And if we go down to the Start button and click on Settings, and then we're going to see the System icon, so I'll click on that. And then in the lower left-hand corner, we'll click on About. Now we see a couple different things down here at the bottom under the Windows specifications. Besides the Windows 10 Pro Edition in this particular case, we also see the version. So version 1903. So the 19 stands for 2019, and then the 03 generally stands for the month that it's in. Now under the installed on, we see the date that it was installed. But here's the OS build that you see 18362. So that's the build number and also the version number. Either one of those, you can do a search, do a Google search to find out what new features are available based on the version or the OS build. I'm in a Google search, so I'll just go ahead and type in Windows 10 build features. Now sometimes the build number and the version get confused. So sometimes people think that the build number is the version number and it's not. So I'm going to change in the tools to show the past month. And I'll click on this Windows Insider for this particular build number, which is 19608. And in here you can see what's new in that particular build. So that way you can decide whether or not you want to upgrade to a newer build than what you have, which you can certainly do so by going to the system icon again and then choosing the updates option. The other thing we can do is just go to a command prompt. I'll just type in CMD for command and type in WINVER for win version. Hit enter and there it tells us the exact same information. There's the version of 1903 and once again, the OS build of 18362. So that's how and why you should find out your build and version number in your Windows operating system.